The Queen has driven to Frogmore to enjoy a family reunion with her grandchildren and great-grandchildren after having COVID. The Queen is understood to have made the five-minute trip from Windsor to Frogmore to spend time with Prince William, Kate Middleton and Princess Beatrice and their children after recovering from COVID. Her Majesty enjoyed an afternoon with family and friends, a week after testing positive. This royal news comes after it was claimed that Kate Middleton's unsure anxiety hints she hasn't mastered Queen's confidence. The Queen is understood to have taken part in a family reunion with her grandchildren and great-grandchildren after recovering from COVID-19. Her Majesty, 95, who celebrates her 70th year on the throne this year, was forced to cancel some official engagements last week after she tested positive for COVID just days after Prince Charles came down with the virus. And while many fans feared for the Queen's health, they will be delighted to know that she has since been reunited with Prince William, Kate Middleton, and their children Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis as well as Princess Beatrice and her baby girl Sienna. Prince Harry and Meghan have let Princess Eugenie and husband Jack Brooksbank stay at Frogmore with their daughter Sienna while the couple are living in LA despite renewing the lease on the property. According to the Daily Mail, the Queen made the short trip from Windsor Castle to Frogmore where younger family members had gathered to see her for the first time since her diagnosis. The royals made use of the glorious sunshine to meet their grandmother who normally drives more regularly to walk her dogs at Frogmore but as of late hadn't made the journey. Prior to the family visit, the Queen was last seen meeting security staff at Windsor Castle on February 16. It's thought that Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank who live at Frogmore Cottage, were not home, as they recently flew to LA and were spotted having dinner with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Her Majesty sparked health fears earlier this year, and last year when she was spotted using a walking stick and had an unexpected hospital stay, after which doctors told her to rest. The Queen is set to celebrate her Platinum Jubilee later this year with a special four-day weekend of events including a concert at Buckingham Palace.